So this map looks bad if you're a Democrat. And quite frankly, I don't want Joe Biden or Donald Trump to be president. But I definitely don't want Donald Trump to be president. But so I'll, today I'll just war game for the Biden camp. Um, so if I was the Biden team and I'm looking at maps that look like this, and you don't have to believe this very one, there are a bunch of others that look exactly the same um, where, you know, Trump wins in every, every scenario. So I, I just don't believe that Biden's team, based off of what they're doing and what Biden is doing, is going to win the day. But if they really wanted to win, they might listen to Elizabeth Warren because she suggests completely removing marijuana from the scheduling system. Like it's marijuana cannabis is considered, I'm not, you shouldn't even call it marijuana. That's some like conjured up, like, you know, a reefer madness. We're just trying to scare you name. I'd just call it cannabis. That'd be good. But everybody slips. Um, yeah, she says remove it as a Schedule 1. Schedule 1 is up there with some of the hardest drugs that you could possibly get. And part of the reasoning for a Schedule 1 drug is allegedly uh, to have no medical benefit, which we all know, or at least have someone around us that definitely knows that there are severe benefits to cannabis use. But um, Elizabeth Warren, along with a bunch of other senators, um, you know, mostly Democrats, but uh, they're really pushing for this. And Republicans are probably going to stay away from this because, of course, they don't want Joe Biden to win. And you know, lifting this, of course, doesn't change what happens in individual states. They're still going to have their same f***ed up laws, but at least at the federal level, it'll be removed and hopefully decriminalized at very minimum. So that way, if, you know, people that sell cannabis want to keep their money, say, in a bank, <laughs> they can actually do that. Crazy thought, you know, um, a bunch of money just sitting in one place just begs to be robbed. That's like, why do we make decisions that have terrible outcomes for people down the line when the answer for everything is just so clear? Biden team.